Hello folks from Slide Nerd, I'm Weaves and I'm back again with another program on patterns. In this bit, I'm gonna show you how to make this triangle. Pretty weird, huh? I keep seeing this and that, this triangle. This is another one. Let's go ahead and see how this is done. In the output, you say enter the size and the guy says 5 and this is what happens. So let's go ahead and show you see how this works. It's pretty simple. If I say print star, it's gonna print 1 star. If I want 4 or 5, I have to put a for loop. I'll say for int j is 4, j greater than 1, j minus minus. It's gonna print 4 stars. Now I want 4 such rows, so I'm gonna put another for loop. I'm gonna say for i is 1, i less than 4, i plus plus. I'm gonna print total 16 stars at the new line at the end, of course. Now, here's the thing you observe i is 1, i is 2, i is 3, i is 4, alright? And j starts from 4 to 1. So let me go ahead and show you something over here. At this place, we have a space. Or there is nothing in short. Do you know why? Observe carefully, j is 1 over here, alright, i is 2, i is bigger than j, right? Okay, now let's see again, here, j is 2, i is 3, j is 1, i is 3, right? Again, here, when i is 3, j is 2, j is 1, j is 3, okay, now, in this case, if you see, whenever, whenever j becomes smaller than i, we don't print anything, right? Again, take a look. I was 4 over here. J became smaller. J became smaller. J became smaller, right? We don't print anything at all. That, that's the condition. We print only if J is bigger than I. Right? If J is smaller than I, we don't print anything. That means J has to be bigger than I for a press star to be printed. So let's go ahead in NetBeans and see how this works. It's a pretty simple program. Alright, here in NetBeans, I have nothing. Just an empty blank project. I'm not going to take any input for this. We are going to do this the hard way without any inputs. So let me go ahead and say int size equals to 5. Alright. First, I'll say system.out.print. I'll print a star over here. Control S, Shift F6. As you can see, there is one star. I'll print a for loop. I'll say 4. Int j equals to size. j greater than equals to 1. j minus minus. Right. Again, Control S, Shift F6. Now there are five stars. I need this five times, so I'm gonna say I have for loop over here again. I'll say for int i equals to one, i less than equals to size i plus plus, and put this entire thing inside. Right? Control S, Shift F6. Now as you can see, it's gonna put all the 16 in the same line. What I want is after five of them I want a new line right so exactly at this for loop end I'm gonna say system dot out dot print ln keep it blank so that I get a new line I'll say control s shift f6 as you can see now it's on five separate lines so now what I want is I don't want these this one over here these two over here these three and these four that's what I don't want right so I'm gonna simply say if j greater than equals to i print a star otherwise simply do nothing right so control s shift f6 as you guys can see it's working perfectly what happens you guys have understood probably it's very simple so if you guys understood what you saw please subscribe to my channel comment let me know what you think about this thanks for watching i'll catch you guys later have a nice day